hello guys welcome to today's video by trust Stanley, and this is a ts tech talk video guys on today's video i'm going to show you guys how to live stream on your youtube channel even though your channel is still new although i'm going to be live streaming on this particular channel it hasn't gotten up to 1k subscriber it's currently on 80 um, 181 subscriber but I've actually tested this on a brand new channel so even though your channel is brand new you don't have enough subscriber you can still live stream making use of this trick so the first thing you need to do is to go ahead and go to android play store and search for this particular application it's called streamlab um streamlab either you type in streamlab or streamlabs this is the exact application right there so go ahead and download the application you are going to notice um the company that uploaded it is called streamlabs so download and install the application. Once you have it installed, go ahead and click on open. So um, when you are opening it, it's going to display all of this option for you. So just click on next. And then I'm going to choose this particular option because I'll, I'm only going to be live streaming on my gaming channel. But if you want to live stream on your gaming channel as well of um, as well of your um, camera, you can choose this particular option. But since I only live stream on game, I'm going to choose this one. So click on next, select default, and then hit save. So it's going to actually um, ask you to enable your camera and your microphone. So I'm going to click on enable, allow, and I'm also going to enable my mic and um, improve that. No thanks. Okay, now you notice it displays this option and says Streamlab will access um, all of the information on your phone. I'm just going to click on start now. And then there is even more settings you need to do, guys. Um, before you actually start live streaming, if you have not actually reached the requirement, you need to go over to... Um, your um, studio area your youtube studio area just type in studio.youtube.com click on continue to studio and make sure you are viewing it as a web um a web version as a desktop version um wait for it to load up so this is actually my channel i'm going to click on this three dotted icon and then i'm going to choose desktop site so when you choose desktop site it's going to display your site as a desktop format Guys, quick note that if you do not choose this option, they are not going to work properly for you. So after you selected this option, you are going to click on this. Um, let me zoom in a little bit so that you see. You notice this icon right there. This is icon for streaming settings, for streaming option. Click on this last icon right here. Uh, so when you click on that stream setting, it's going to actually bring you here. But if it doesn't bring you here for some reason, um, I'm going to have to minimize this because it's actually showing that it's live so um usually it might bring you to this particular section right here but this is actually not the set showing you you need to you need to select the first one that has that um antenna or network icon click on that when you click on that it brings you to this area so what you need to copy is actually um you need to copy the stream key and the stream url but i already have that copied and i have it saved on um my notes on my samsung note uh it should be right here so I already have them copied. So all you need to do is to, this is actually my stream key and it's not meant to be displayed to the public. So come over to the application right here, click on this area and then click on um, account settings. And now it's going to give you option to log in into account, but do not worry, there is no need for you to log in. Just click on this custom RUMPT, click on that and it's going to ask you for a name. So I'm going to call this um, YouTube. You can just give it any name you want. But I'm just going to call this YouTube custom. Just give it whatever name you like you want. The name doesn't actually matter. What actually matters is the URL and the stream key. So this is actually the stream key I copied then. I just pasted it. And then um, come right here and copy the stream URL. This is stream URL. So I just copied that out also. And then I'm going to come right here and then paste the URL. So um, actually the URL did not copy it properly. I don't know why. Let me highlight again. Um, I ended up cutting it. Okay. So um, come right back and then paste the URL. So once you have pasted the URL, just go ahead and click on save and it will be saved. So when you are ready to go live, all you need to do is actually click on go live and then click on select platform and then choose that custom URL you just created right now click on that and it's going to uh, um, appear this way so click on next and it's going to ask you for the title of your live stream so i'm going to give it a title i'm going to call this um live playing pack let me just give space Come on. 
two prices and then um you can add a description if you want to and then the next is to actually add um just go live add a description and then just hit on go live and you are going to notice right there the live stream started so i can actually check this on my second device to confirm if the live stream went or if i'm actually live let me show you guys on this device so um on this device right now it should show if i'm currently live and you notice i'm actually live i just went live right now so um you can also confirm that on the youtube application um, by coming over to the youtube section going over to uh, my channel and i have to scroll down this is actually live video so right now i'm currently live and this is just how to do it if you haven't reached the requirement for the youtube live streaming um option so this is all i want to show you guys on today's video and i hope it's helpful um if it is please smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video and guys i will see you on my next video please stay safe and peace